Hello friends, very good evening. Welcome back to my YouTube channel Trade with AS and myself Bala here. And I am welcome you all to my YouTube channel. And this video, I am going to discuss my uh, trades and also I am going to create you the scan for 15 minutes ORB strategy. And this time, I am going to create you the scanner for bearish breakout. So, two, two days back, we made video regarding bullish breakout. Uh, on 15 minutes ORB strategy so we find out some uh, stocks based on today in in the copper so maybe a stop loss trade and then another one we got it that is what not triggered the entry point that is what a bandhan bar so only two stocks we find out first one is a in copper and then i am going to show you what is happening on in the copper and this is what a breakout one so initially it breaks out and it moves small and the stop loss is triggered so someone were asking about the doubt mm -hmm. how we can do the trade based on uh, the strategy so it was a strategy where we are going to find out the stock for a breakout right so if the stop loss is bigger so simply avoid the stocks okay that should be a best way if the stop loss is very small or it is suitable to you you can place the orders on the stock or else you just track and uh, test how the system is working so indi copper is the one which we got it and triggers our entry and finally it hit our stop loss the second stock i think bandhan bar that was in the radar we are watching for uh, the 15 minutes breakout let's look at that the gap between uh, first 15 minutes is a huge one around 248 and 241 the large size also be big on the stock and it was giving you some breakout but it was not triggered your breakout up to 10 o'clock at 10 o'clock it triggers and then finally it gone and it was triggered your stop loss the big stop loss that got triggered today okay and the remaining trades which we have tried today in bank nifty and nifty there is a two opportunities which to find out in nifty and the result that should be entry i was just trying in a five minutes time frame around the 200 level so simple trade which I have done with this uh, particular dojic hammer candle. So this hammer I was trying to take an entry 202 in the earlier stage. And I, I was trying to break out this level also. I am waiting for breakout 247. And initially it not broken and it was going down. And I find out opportunity by hammer at the low. And it was giving you profit again the breakout and it went up to maximum uh, nearby 380 plus that went so maybe the good opportunity where we find out as uh, bank of t 43,000 put option which i have selected for my breakout and initially it given a false breakout and i was keeping my stop loss around um, maybe 580 level and that is also triggered the stop loss but nifty there is a two opportunities that was working well but bank of t two times it was triggering my stop sorry one time and then it again break out around 660 and today uh, it jumps over 2100 so another great opportunity and also i try to find out an opportunity around 580 again but this time i cannot able to get it these are the trades i have finding out on my real time market so real time live videos which we are doing on a market hours in the first one of first two hours we are trying to do and based on the classes avail available so i just uh, wind up the session earlier or sometimes it may be taking two hours sometimes one and a half hours at least on that first one and a half hours we are going to find out some trade opportunities almost four trades one two stop loss two success maybe a 50 percent no problem so but the risk reward ratio that always pays you the problems okay previous video uh, we are trying to create the orb strategy right 15 minutes ORB strategy for a bullish breakout. Now I'm going to create the stock for a bearish one. So the same kind of thing which we are going to use in a charting. So I'm going to give you the how to create the charting scanner. Now on 15 minutes ORB strategy breakout and the stock for a breakout on the 15 minutes ORB. You know well about what is ORB strategy and the 15 minutes range should be break either a downside or a higher side that i am going to focus for my opportunity so i just go to create a scan and i am going to create you the scan and i just always focus with the futures and option stocks i just 
create and here i'm just going to uh, low that should be a 15 minute scanner which i'm going to create first of all we could give the time 15 minutes um, low of ecanashi candle that i'm calling for ecanashi candle 15 minutes low must be less than must be less than a minus one ecanashi low and i'm going to make that minus one 15 minutes so previous one we are using greater than and the higher highs here we are going to uh, create with the lower lows and the second condition which i am going to make uh, the condition is volume so volume i am just focusing both the sides would be greater than so maybe the previous volume must be greater than and previous one volume minus 1 15 minutes volume this will find out uh, the movement the volume high volume in a stock that may be giving you the uh, opportunity and then i'm going to find out a range for a particular day's range should be greater than the previous day's one so that i use the bracket function so simply i'm going to use the latest high minus latest low so the following the step and you can create yesterday also one of the uh, my subscribers who are asking in the doubt and he was now he is ready to create his own scan by using following this video and don't skip at this step just focus clearly what i'm doing here right now so maybe that one you can follow and you may be creating your own scanner right so the latest flow and then this would be a one day ago the same condition we are going to use some other factors and then we copy and we paste this so if i'm going to check so a lot of stocks we are finding out but it's about a 15 minutes breakout and i'm going to find out the stock should not be a positive day it should be a negative day like look at that astral poly Amar Raja batteries are positive stocks today. So using some filters, I can find out only the negative stocks. The close price must be less than the open. Maybe if it is, I'm giving you less than open should be the stock. It's negative one. If I'm just getting these are the stocks are very minimum loss or compared to the uh, open price, it may be negative only. But compared to the previous close, this may be positive. Look at that. We get a almost 41 stocks it's not a good to see <clears throat> all the 41 stocks for my trading and you can see uh, here open and here i'm going to make a close maybe the negative close compared to previous day and uh, today also be negative and today should be a, a comparatively previous day low and we got a only 38 stock as of now we filter out the stock and again i'm going to create the same conditions but two days higher conditions comparing the next two days the current day with the next two days the same condition which i have already created on the previous one here i'm just finding out the stock which focusing for selling opportunity so just i just created and we have only 15 stock so we have initially 45 stocks by using a condition we have filtered out some 5 10 stocks and now almost we filtered some 30 stocks from this list and now and i'm going to use the rsi functions the rsi 14 period rsi also i'm just taking for a study here it must be less than the rsi it must be less than the rsi 14 i'm just going to take one day ago the rsi is keep going down sorry not one week ago it's about a one day ago and again i'm going to create the same conditions two days ago means it's a rsi uh, it is keep on going down so those conditions so, and also i'm going to use here uh, almost 13 stocks right now i find out and now i'm going to even filter out the stock must be uh, less than the sma period 50 moving average if i'm using that conditions even we can filter out some stocks uh, like close price of that must be less than less than sme simple moving average i'm just taking the latest close is about 50 period simple moving average so now the scanner is ready it's ready to uh, take an uh, 15 minutes orb bullish as well as 15 minutes orb bearish so i'm just going to uh, run the scan look at that how many stocks almost 12 stocks i'm getting right now maybe so these 12 stocks are looking good at this moment for uh, one only one got filtered out from this list and one day ago close everything is right 
stocks maybe this stocks which we can focus for bearish one so if you get bullish only two stocks and bear is almost 13 stocks that may be giving you the confirmations the overall trend of the market may be negative so i'm just creating the scanner based on the scanner i'm just following the steps the next step would be i'm going to focus the stock for my uh, breakout trades so i'm just going to save the scan first and just already we have the scanner 15 minutes uh, bullish breakout and now we can save the name as a 15 minutes uh, bearish breakout just i'm going to copy that bearish means bearish breakout so no over the so i'm just uh summit it and now the scanner is ready and always i'm just focusing the stock from the top to bottom so here i'm going to change the percentage wise and i got a lot of stocks and i'm going to check these stocks what i am going to do on it or even uh, we can if you want to the momentum so ats may be the momentum indicator rsi telling in the uh, strength maybe rsi less than which looks good or even you can use the greater than also greater than that is also giving you some stocks i hope we will check that that it is no so rsi is greater than two days no so maybe the best one should be a less than if you are using adx and it might be a greater than because it is the trend finder okay now hdfc amc is the first one and bsoft and two days back we are focusing hdfc amc hdfc amc it was working well and going good and today's 15 minutes where it is this one the first 15 minutes and it was exactly bullish candle and why i'm looking this stock for selling opportunities maybe hfc amc 2200 and 2235 this is what the risk which uh, i'm just finding out on the first 15 minutes even though this stock if it is breaks above the day high i'm not considered for a bullish breakout because this stock i selected for a bearish one and it should be a bearish breakout stock and it broke in from 2200 and 2136 may it worked very well so and uh sorry i was just made a mistake okay it's about uh, this thing happening at 3 30 okay so what we are going to do then the back test we can take only 9 15 candles uh, at 9 15 so today uh, we have very few number of stocks okay so two four six stocks delta com take came base of metropolis train and Kodai. So just this is the result at 315 candle, 315 to 330 candle. I don't want to focus it. And just Kodak Bank is the number one trend, and I'm going to focus. Kodak Bank, what is, what is happening? Okay, look good at this moment. Um, 1814, 1826. Maybe a 12 point risk, just about a 12 point risk on this particular stock. It's looking good because the stock value is 1800. 12 point is not a big risk and it breaks below 1814 finally it coming down 1771 so maybe more than uh, 30 40 points is down from that breakdown which is happening on kodak magendra bank and the second one trend and metropolis that will be going to check trend what is happening on trend that was a big candle maybe around 1000 to 252 to 89 maybe near about 35 points it breaks uh, that level of the low 1252 and it coming down towards 1235 maybe 20 points and end of the day it closed positive but this may be a i am suggesting this is as a some high risky trade so very big risk and metropolis base of metropolis is another one uh, metropolis what is happening here metropolis looking at this maybe a hand and this one looking at a spinning top kind of candy 74 to 60 14 point risk on metropolis the low is broken on 1360 and finally 1330 so maybe more than one is to two risk reward ratio that generated on metropolis and bsoft take him bsoft is the one which we got today and the bsoft what is up yeah, here you can see uh, this stock we are waiting for a only a selling opportunity sell only because this one selected for a 15 minutes ORB uh, ORB down stocks or negative stocks and here it breaks high I don't want to take entry and only selling I'm just focusing for the stock the sale is triggered and it finally goes down from that level 
the rest was 88 to 91 so just about uh, 3 rupees and it broken that level of 88 and coming down to 82 maybe more than 6 rupees that is also working well and uh, take came and delta cup only final take came take came yeah that is also working well 1011 to 1004 maybe around 7 rupees it coming down to 986 and finally delta bond maybe there's one or two stocks which we can focus oh, oh that one is expired so if anyone who want to open a trading account with don so just follow the link which i provided in the description and you can start your account with don and it is having a lot of benefits and if you wish to join with that link you can uh, join and open an account so everybody here so it was locked in the morning so still it is running so that is the reason it was closed out this is happening here now and just searching it the market close login what is happening here okay let me go to that so if you want to any other questions or a doubt you just comment on the comment box and also i just start uh, doing uh, the bank nifty scalping course on monday so if anyone who interested you can just contact the number which i shown in the description so just i'm going to close all the windows if you want to start with the trading account with don so the link for the trading account in don so it will, will be mentioned here in the description you can uh, copy the link and you can start your don trading account and maybe a zero brokerage for an investment okay so what is the stock delta cup take we already seen delta cup on 15 minutes time frame i was focusing here where is the first 15 minutes here is the first 15 minutes today and it breaks below 213 and it fall down towards 208 and the risk higher level risk is 214 maybe uh 200 and what is the 15 minutes the low of that sorry this is the, the first 15 minutes candle and uh, maybe it was initially triggers your stop or maybe it started below the low and we should wait for the break below the low of 213 and it was triggered the high maybe it uh, we can take it as a stop loss kind of trick we don't know what exactly the confirmation is where the open is lower than the previous low maybe it open lower and it may be going down initially or after the high it may coming down and finally it close maybe anything can happen so we may be uh, confirming this as a stop loss trade from 213.5 to 214.65 and after the stop loss it was working well in delta com and these are the stocks we find out and what about the stocks by yesterday that i find out only one stock only few stocks at the 5th of january i think one stock i find out is about uh, titan bajaj finance bajaj finance is about huge gap down and i don't want to take bajaj finance and you can copy see here there's a big gap down i don't want to take and titan apollo hospital so titan what is happening on titan may be good at this moment and it broke in the loop and now it is still moved out titan and apollo hospital apollo sorry apollo hospital and uh, that is also big one so you you need to calculate the risk is suitable to you you can go for it other than otherwise you just watch the trade and if any have uh, any other uh, reversal opportunities if you are finding out on the trades that may be a good one you can go for it and now this is the scanner and if you want to take any trade opportunity sorry any screenshot at this moment so you can take the screenshot this is what the exact scanner and you can go through the video and follow the steps to create the scan and make use of your own and this one for a 15 minutes orb strategy bearish uh, we are saving that bearish breakout so what i'm going to do i'm going to save in this one bearish breakout okay so 15 minutes bearish breakout kind of trade which we can focus on this particular stock may be looking good and uh, should be a great one so for your opportunity okay i hope uh, this may be a useful video where you are going to uh, make your your own scan and yesterday one guy who connect me and he was successfully creating the scanner and if you have any doubts or a question you just whatsapp me the number 
and if you have any other uh, questions you can comment on the comment box i will reply on your comment thank you for being with me and thank you for subscribing my channel and big thanks to all my subscribers we are reaching more than 500 subscribers right now thank you for being a good support on my youtube channel thank you so much thanks for being with me let's see on another video thank you